Yeah, I think it was awesome for both of our girls to represent us. Um, I think they did a very good job. I think they each had to, had to identify a new role with their new teams and coaching staff and then learn how to flourish in that role all along while playing a very high level of volleyball that they don't see in the States. Um, the biggest difference was serving and passing. Europeans serve harder than anybody I've ever played against. The ball was different than we played with, so it just floated differently. Um, I think Rigo did a very good job because Rigo was in a new position for her. Um, she was When she entered the tournament, she was the third outside on the team, and that was something that was new for her, and she had to learn how to adapt in that role and really just learn from her teammates. She had four foreign players on her team, which I think was pretty cool. That was actually the only team that had that. Um, and I think that was a good experience for her to see the type of volleyball that they play, have a language barrier, and have to interact with those teammates as well as the U.S. girls on our team. Um, and I think she did a very good job in her role. Playing with five Europeans was probably the most interesting thing I had to deal with because their style and their pace is so different from ours. But I really think my team did well gelling both American and European styles together. Off the court, I learned a lot of culture and definitely a lot of languages from my teammates. They taught me all about their from back home and like what they eat compared to what we eat. It was fun. We had a, um, our group of kids was from the two, 2014 class all the way through juniors in college. So we had a wide range of age and that was fun to get them to do the same thing. Learn their role, figure out how to flourish in their role and be successful against a much higher level than they were used to. And we actually, Lowe's team beat us which was fun. Um, it was fun to coach against one of our girls. She did a really good job right before and after the match. We uh, actually met before and after and we just told her we were proud of her and um, you know we're going to challenge her. We're going to put her in a position where she knows that we're coming at her and she responded very well. She was definitely the leader of her group um, from day one through the end of the tournament. She was the ringleader and that was really important for us to see her go into a group of strangers and learn how to lead. It was an awesome experience to make it to the finals. Uh, the crowd that we played in front of was probably one of the biggest crowds I've ever played with. We played against the only team that beat us in the tournament. Um, they practiced together five days a week. They're a really strong team. So it was just a great experience to play at that level, to play in front of people like that, and just get me ready for season. Um, this experience will help me in so many ways. I learned how to play with a team that I've never played with, so playing with girls that I've played with for couple years now it's just going to seem like it's easy serving and passing wise um, I won't see anybody in the states that serve as hard as they did and leadership wise I just learned how to lead in tough situations and pressure situations it was just learning how to lead girls that you've never played with makes girls leading girls that you've played with a lot easier